Well, the second day of Toledo Jeep Fest is coming to an end. And earlier, 1,500 Jeeps rolled through downtown Toledo in the parade. Our Christy Gerlet went to the festival, talked to all the Jeep drivers and fans of the iconic vehicle. She joins us live in studio this evening. So, Christy, how much fun were the people having down there? Lots and lots of fun. The weather was great. The sun was shining. Of course, there were loads and loads of Jeeps and loads and loads of ducks. This is definitely the best one so far that I've been to. Because? Uh, a lot more people and a lot more ducks, I feel like. We definitely got triple the amount of ducks this time. So it was a fantastic parade. We really loved it. People that drive Jeeps are, are what make Jeeps the most interesting and unique because the passion and the camaraderie and the sense of adventure among Jeepers is different than any, any other audience I've seen anywhere, more or less vehicle drivers. This type of uh, fest is different than a lot of them because it's based in you know the city and you get to see more of the culture in the downtown and stuff instead of a field. What makes a Jeep better than any other type of vehicle out there? Well, none better than taking the doors off and cruising the streets, right? I mean, we lived in Knoxville for three years and cruising the Smoky Mountains with the doors off. I mean, don't get much better than that. They're, They're fun to ride in, like when the doors are off. What was your favorite Jeep? The pink one. Favorite part of the day, what was it? Walking around and getting stuff. That, yeah. I just had the luxury of meeting a wonderful group of people who helped me build my Jeep, taught me a lot about automotive, and just built me as a person. And I think that is alive and well in the Jeep community. It really is a community. It is. Um, maybe a cult. <laughs> I'm not quite sure. GFest is really a year-round endeavor, so as soon as this one's over, we'll start planning for 2024. Already? Oh yeah, already. It's just a really, it's grown to be such a huge event. Well, it is a huge event. Jeremy Rowe played in Hensville tonight. That concert was free. Love that. Tomorrow there will be more fun with a run and walk. Emphasize on the walk. I like that. Chase, I'll send it to you.